welcome to another Nestor unboxing. <laughs> Just received this recently. I would like to share with you the experience of unboxing this new item. If you're interested in finding out what's in this box, stay tuned. This is really interesting. I've never received an Amazon box that was so sealed so properly. And on the front, not sure if you can see that. It has that seal all the way around. And basically it says, if seal is broken, check the contents. Let's check it out. the most exciting time. <laughs> that is that is really packed in well. Woo. <laughs> I've never had a box so packed so well, but rightfully so this is the new Panasonic Lumix S5 very very exciting i'm acquired this what's in here owner's manuals very very important ah very nice camera strap usb-c cable very usb-c charger nice oh that's the actual charger and then the battery very very important wow look at that it actually sits in a tray oh it's really fancy the new panasonic s5 can you see that Here's the back of it, the top, the bottom. So there's your quarter inch. Wow, it's so, wow. Th th so holding it is amazing. Like it was ergonomically designed. It's very nice. And then, um, so this lens is a 20 to 60 millimeter zoom lens. Zooms and all that. Ah. So let's. This is the Lumix S5 4K mirrorless full frame lens. So I'm not sure if you could see that. There you go. Very nice. Actually, it feels the balancing of it is amazing. The kit lens, while it looks super heavy, it's not. It does come with a hood also. Oh, I've never. Oh, nice. So there's the hood just to. Give it some shade from the sun. In the front there, you can control the white balance and the ISO and then um, exposure right there. Here is your exposure for photography and there is your button for to film. And then of course your mode dials. There are three custom buttons. I like the custom buttons. This is a 24.2 megapixel CMOS sensor. I am on a quest 
to find a camera that I can vlog with that has decent stabilization, which means when I'm vlogging with the camera, I want to be able to hold it without the image being all jittery and shaky. Panasonic S5 now has a newly designed contrast base autofocus. I'm very used to the Sony system where the autofocus is very good. As a matter of fact, I'm shooting on a Sony camera right now and obviously it has 4K, 25 and 30 frames per second. But it also has 4K, 60 frames per second. In addition, this will acquire images at 10 bit 422. And what simply what that basically means is that when it captures, it will give you the widest dynamic range, which means you can capture in post edit more shadows, more colors, sharpness, etc. This will also film at a maximum of 180 frames per second in full HD. Plus, this camera now has pre-installed Vlog and Gamut. That is more for color grading, taking advantage again of the full dynamic range that this camera can produce. On the top here is your dial. On the back here is your autofocus. So there are more controls on top and on the back. The other thing I'm very excited about is this awesome flip out screen. <laughs> so the flip out screen, you can angle it up and down, but more importantly, you could flip it. And then now when you're vlogging or you're filming yourself, you actually can see yourself position your head so that you're in the image and whatever is in the back that you would like to capture. This camera is dust and splash resistant. The other thing I like about this camera is that it will do a 96 megapixel high resolution mode with JPEG. What does that mean? That means if you take a picture of something that is stationary, it will take multiple pictures of that item, thing, mountain, whatever, and then it will superimpose those images on top of each other, creating a 96 megapixel. Is part of the L mount alliance. What that means is that there are multiple companies that share this particular mount so that this lens will fit another manufacturer's camera and vice versa. There is a, co a company that produces mostly lenses and that is Sigma. Sigma will create an L mount lens that will fit any camera that is within that L mount alliance. And that is Panasonic, Leica. Those are the two that I know. <laughs> but yeah, this is the camera. I'm very, very excited about it. If you have any questions about this camera, please comment. Obviously, if you like this video, please give me a big old thumbs up. It helps our channel uh, greatly. But until then, thank you for your time. I really appreciate your contributions to our channel. I hope you have a great day.